Hey guys, so today I want to try out something new. Since you've always seen me with long hair, so I actually want to do an experiment. What would I look like with short hair and also with a different hair color? So I will not be doing it on my hair, of course. <laughs> However, I will be doing it on one of my blonde wigs. Alright you guys, so my hair is now in a very tight French braid. So I'm gonna wear this first and measure it on my head. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I look so weird, okay. So now I am simply going to cut this. I'm just not gonna cut this freestyle for now because I'm gonna even it out later. So don't you worry, you guys, don't you worry. I would like to settle at this length, but let's cut it even shorter. <laughs> just because I know some of you would probably tell me that this is not even short, this is medium length. So yes sis, I hear you. This is a tutorial on how not to cut your hair. I'm afraid to mess up this wig just because if I mess it up, it's like messed up forever. Because this is not gonna grow anymore. <laughs> It's gonna remain like this. Okay. Okay. Okay, sis. Okay. <gasps> what is this? It's a rebel. There's always that one rebellious hair. It just doesn't want to cooperate. You know my issue about like this color, the shade of blonde on me? Is that in the camera it looks okay, but in real life, if I have this hair color, I would look like a walking cornfield. Like, no joke. So this is exactly why I would never go blonde. <laughs> Alright, so here it is, you guys. What do y'all think? <laughs> okay. I think it would be great if we would kind of like, um, as I've said, dye it and also style this. So just so that it doesn't look like this. But anyway, this is me with short hair. Alright, you guys. So here it is. Saying goodbye to this blonde wig. There's no turning back. We're dyeing it. We're dyeing it in a darker shade. <laughs> I'm so scared of dyeing actually my real hair. Probably, okay. I feel like the safest thing I could do is like remove this wig from my hair and then put it on my head mannequin. Alright, so currently that's what it looks like. Okay, so now that we're still waiting for the color to develop on the wig, I'm gonna give a shout out to the sponsor of this video, which is Skillshare. Now, Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creators. It's curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads, and they're always launching new premium classes, so you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. Skillshare has thousands of inspiring classes for creative and curious people on topics including photography, creative writing, animation, fine art, music and music production, film and video, marketing, productivity, freelance and entrepreneurship, and crafts. Now personally for me, the one that I'm learning is the video for Instagram, tell an engaging story in less than a minute by Halise. And this is a very fun and helpful class since right now I'm trying to make short Insta videos. And she made me realize that I don't really have to have all of the fancy equipment to make a very fun and creative Insta video. All right, so that's it you guys. The first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get a one month free trial of Skillshare so you can start exploring your creativity today. All right, you guys, so this is what the wig looks like right now. This is the color. All right, so what I'm going to be doing is I'm just gonna blow dry the hair and that's it. And this is what it looks like. <laughs> it's funny how hairstyles and hair color can really change your look. All right, so this time I'm gonna go ahead and try and kind of curl it. I had so much fun playing with this wig. So anyway, this is what it looks like. I like this hair curl since it gave it some body and it doesn't look like a wig anymore. <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below which do you guys prefer. Do you like the blonde color 
or the brunette one. For me, I really do prefer brunette because just because I feel like it actually complements my skin tone more than the blonde. Also, do you all think short hair fits me? <laughs> so that is it. Please don't forget to check Skillshare if you all want to learn a new skill or if you're just simply interested in taking up on one of the classes that they offer. All right, see you all in my next video. Bye.